What's up guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome to Dubai and welcome to this week in the life of a cabin crew. So the reason why I'm actually doing this video is because I just want to take you guys along with me, show you what exactly I do on my days off, in between flights, on flights, I'll probably take you on a trip or two. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. First things first, let's go to the movies. <laughs> Good morning guys, starting off the day right, we have a coffee. We actually have an espresso machine at home, so it's quite straightforward every morning. Cappuccinos, macchiatos, espressos, whatever we want. Uh, last night we went to watch Doctor Strange, really enjoyed it, no, no spoilers. Um, how many of you are actually still Marvel fans? Like, it's just interesting to know because every time a Marvel movie comes out, I'm the first one at the cinema. Um, but I know that a lot of people are actually kind of over it now. But if you are still a Marvel fan, comment down below. Let me know what you've been thinking recently about these Marvel movies and who is your favorite Marvel character. Uh, as you can see, I look horrible. I need a haircut and a shave. So let's get that done. Back home now, and we are starving! Time to eat! And lunch is served, so we've got some pasta. You know how every time I go to Europe and I buy those frozen, ready-made pastas that you just have to boil? Well, this is it! We made a white sauce with mushroom and cheese, thrown some parmigiano on top, and obviously some fresh basil. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not gonna show you every single meal every single day, because that makes gonna make the video way too long and way too boring. We're going to have this. This is probably going to be dinner as well. Watch some Seinfeld. I'll catch you guys later on. So 9.30 in the evening, just walked into the apartment now. 10,000, you can't see that. 10,507 steps completed. Priya and I, we try to do at least 10,000 a day. Uh, today was a bit of walking, a little bit of jogging as well. Nothing too strenuous. Then we're going to have dinner. Same thing we had for lunch, actually. We have a little bit of leftovers. So we're going to eat that and then have some fruit as well. Um, tomorrow, lots to do, very busy, uh, lots of errands to run. Um, and then actually one of our friends are coming to stay over for the evening. Look at all this food, guys. We are here in Ajman. It's actually not Dubai. It's another emirate in the UAE. And we've come to this restaurant. Priya's here, Kyle is here, and Caught in the action, Sunil is here. So we're just having some lunch. Like I said, he's meeting us today. And we've still got more food, right? We've got one more thing to come as well. Yep. We're gonna snack on this. And then obviously, you know what we're having next. Shisha time. We're back at home. We actually went to the beach today. It was such a nice, relaxing day. Just look at these waves. We just chilled out of there, Priya and myself. We ended up taking a few snacks with us and did a whole lot of nothing. Now back to reality, we've got to go to work. Time to head to Johannesburg. Seven and a half hours later, we have made it to Joburg, guys. So I'm starving and I am so tired. So I'm quickly going to take my uniform off and go and eat. I didn't eat on the flight because I knew I was going to devour everything here in Johannesburg. Let me quickly show you the room because we actually haven't stayed here in a long time. This is the bed with a nice big headboard and pictures and wallpaper, full length mirror. You can't see the view obviously because it is nighttime as you can see. That is the hanging area, hanging space area, excuse me, safe and the fridge. Then we go back into the room, TV, I throw my suitcase and my cabin bag down there. I've actually made myself a cup of tea just because I'm so hungry so hopefully that will do for the next few minutes. Tea and coffee station, then this is the bathroom shower area the toilet is actually here behind this door here so this is the room time to go and eat round one and we've got some chicken wings we are at rocker mama's of course i've got a coke as well round two I don't even know what's in this burger, but it looks divine. Look at the chilies, look at the cheese, look at the sauce. 
got some beef bacon hiding in the back there as well. Back in the room and that burger was divine. So for the burger, the wings and the Coke, it's 190 Rand, so like 45, 50 Durham, pretty cheap. But because I had so many chilies and my stomach is killing me inside, I decided to go for round number three. We got a Ferrero milkshake. Now this hotel is known for their milkshakes. I can't get anything. I hate paper straws, but it tastes so good. I can hardly get anything through there. Oh, milkshake to wash it all down. And um, now I'm going to shower, watch some TV, do some video calls, and then head to bed because uh, tomorrow we're going to be running around, getting breakfast and doing the grocery shopping. And like I promised you guys, we are at breakfast. I got my eggs, I got some mushrooms, bacon. I took this beef thing that they have and a chicken thing that they have. I think that was probably from last night's dinner service. Uh, then they also got some pastries. I got a cinnamon roll, croissant, and I've got a muffin. And don't ask me what flavor that is, but it is a Kit Kat on top, so I have to take it. I got some orange juice, water, and a decaf coffee. So this is breakfast, and then we go and do some grocery shopping. I'll see you guys back in the room. Okay guys, so my shopping haul is done. I'm actually gonna quickly run to the bank. Just get some errands over and done with. Don't you just love being in South Africa? Uh, somebody recently, a South African, recently asked me to show you guys what I get, but I think I usually do that anyway. So let me show you all the good, juicy things that we did buy. So I got a whole lot of different types of chips. Obviously, South Africans are going to be familiar with this. That's the original knickknacks. And then I absolutely just love the chutney flavor of the Simba chips. Then I got two of these ginger beer, non-alcoholic, because that's what I like to drink with my vodka, like a Moscow mule. Then I got some speckled eggs. That's actually for one of my friends. I got some biscuits, the um, Mari biscuits. And then I've also got Romney creams, chocolate flavor, and then chocolates, also chocolate flavor. These are really nice South African biscuits, Baker's brand. Then these are the teas that I really like to drink. We have the green rooibos and then the rooibos and chamomile as well. Those are really, really good. Then onto the good stuff, we got meat. I got lamb. What's that? Three packs of those braai chops. And then I've got just a little bit of beef. I just said I'm not going to buy too much of that. Then I got some pork sausages. I got some chicken viennas because we just love that. Um, I've got a fresh orange juice. That's to drink now. This is, what is this? This is um, eye drops of Priya. She also wanted these uh, rice cakes. I got the yogurt flavor and then the chocolate flavor. And that looks like, oh, and then I also got this pickle, this like mango pickle that this brand, Paco, I actually always buy it, but not the mango, a different one, but we went with that anyway, because that's all they had. But yeah, guys, this is my grocery haul. Time to put that into my suitcase somehow. And then uh, I will see you guys when I'm getting ready. Two hour nap done. We are back in uniform and ready to head downstairs back to Dubai. I've just packed my suitcase and it is bulging. Like, I think I just bought way too many things. Um, so it's gonna be super heavy. We're gonna go back to Dubai seven and a half hours back at five o'clock in the morning, so it's gonna be a long night. I see you guys back in Dubai. Just got home from the mall now. It was Priya's aunt's birthday today, so we went to the Cheesecake Factory and had lunch with her and then to Paul's and had a bit of cake. Um, yesterday I got back from Johannesburg, landed at 5.15, got home into bed around 7.30. Woke up around 12, had coffee, felt more groggy, and went back to bed. Woke up around 3 eventually, so it wasn't a very productive day. But um, today's been a lot better. Not, did nothing else at the mall, actually, no shopping or groceries, nothing at all. Uh, chilling out now, gonna work on this video, editing this video, and then we'll eventually head to bed because tomorrow we are going back to work. I've got a Cairo turnaround. 
I'm not going to take you guys along with me because it is just to turn it on. So nothing much to see. We're leaving early in the morning, I think 10-ish, back by 6 in the evening or something like that. Um, not too much of a long day, but I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Just showing you what I do kind of in Dubai on my days off, what I have to go through. Um, just showing you that I actually do have a normal life. We can go out, meet our friends, uh, meet our family if we do have family here. Spend time in Dubai with our family if you're married like I am. Um, and yeah, just have a normal life. Make sure you do give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what you thought of the video. And I will see you guys next week.